Okay, what is up guys? Welcome back to our video. So I'm here today at a little pond right across from my house. You guys have definitely seen me here before. Um, today's target is a little multi-species action. Um, we're gonna try to catch some bass and crappie today. Uh, I have a little crappie jig on a really light rod and I'm also gonna toss some jigs and spinner baits for bass and pike. So we have like an hour or two till sunset. Just got done uh, school. It's gonna get dark pretty shortly. It's like 50 degrees right now, guys. Just had a small little warm front pass through. Uh, had snow a few weeks ago, some snow this weekend, so some last dish uh, winter fishing while we still have some water. No ice in this lake yet, but um, yeah, let's make some casts and hopefully we catch some fish. Let's make our first little cast right here, set this rod up, this little two piece. Off a little three or four foot little cast right there. Hopefully there's some fish close to shore. Some little panfish might be a little closer. I don't know about bass, but I got a pretty strong headwind, so I'm just gonna work this bank a little bit. Hopefully pull up a little crappie or some bluegill water or something. Uh, water's probably like 40 degrees right now, guys. Water's definitely freezing. Right hovering above that freezing mark, probably. Third cast. Give it like five or six casts uh, with this little jig. Switch up locations a little bit, walk this bank. Oh, fish on. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Oh, nice, dude. Nice, nice, nice. Awesome, man. That is so sick. That's so unexpected. Woo! Did not know there was a population of these in there. Oh, awesome, guys. Look what I just caught. Tiny little yellow perch right here, guys. Awesome little fish. So unexpected, right by the bank and just absolutely smacked. I've only caught one of them ever before here and really bad picture of it, but this, this guy looks a little better. Awesome little perch, guys. Beautiful fish. Let's give him a quick release. Sick, dude, sick. Alright, here we go. Alright, in that cold water. Yeah guys, that was so sick. I did not know there was an uh like a population of them in here. I thought I only caught like that one. Uh yeah, crush right by the bank, like fifth cast, right around this little cove right here. So make some more casts, maybe switch up through some bass gear and hopefully we catch some more fish guys. That was sick. Alright. First cast right there caught that little perch. Crush it right by the bank, dude. Like, seriously, probably two or three feet. Not two or three feet, like one or two feet right from the bank. Just gonna work this little cove right here. Who knows, maybe there's some, maybe there's some fish around here. I don't know. That is so awesome. Five, five or six minutes of me being here. Just being a nice little cold water, cold water bite maybe, I don't know. All right, let's round this corner, head back and see what we can do. Fish on. Fish on. No way. Another perch, dude. Another perch. That's so sick. Second perch, guys. Found a little body of them right here. I wonder if I can lip these guys. Maybe I'll learn my lesson today, but all right. Look at that little dude. Stud. Freaking fat, beautiful fish, guys. We'll snap a quick pick with them over here, and we'll let them go. That is so sick, guys. Two perch back to back. I mean, if I catch another one, I know there's definitely a little population of them here. Wow, that is so awesome. I might just scrap any plans of bass fishing and just slay some perch. Caught three perch today. No, two, uh, two perch today. Only caught like four in my entire life, maybe five. Did not. I mean, they're pretty common here in New Jersey, but. Just did another run here, right here around me. Give you a better look what we're using. So we're using this guy right here on a little ultralight rod with like probably 12 pound test, little pink crappie tube jig. Um, yeah. Sick dude. I'm gonna walk around this corner a little bit more. Then I'll come back, maybe toss it over that point. 
switch up, do some bass fishing slash pike, pickerel, um, with spinner baits and jigs. But who knows, dude? Maybe there could be a few more of these guys. I'd love to catch like two or three more. Not what I came here looking for, but definitely pleasantly surprised. Already caught two fish within 10 minutes, and that is not a bad day by any any means. All right, guys, I just retired the tube jig for the crappie slash yellow perch, I guess now, um, and we're using this little um, spinner bait, dollar Walmart spinner bait. It's just absolute trash. Nothing special about it, but I'm um, gonna toss a spinner bait right here for some uh, snot rockets, maybe some bass. Um, who knows? Who knows what I'll eat this today? But hopefully we catch some fish. If not, my backup plan is always just gonna go for those little panfish. So start making some casts with this guy. Uh, hopefully we catch some fish, guys. It's a good day so far. Ten minutes caught two little perch. Super stoked about that. So let's continue the good vibes and let's catch some fish. Alright guys, looks like we're tying the bass jig too. Not one tap on this guy either, so I'm running low on visible filming light, so I'm gonna get this jig back out there, pack my stuff up real quick, make myself a little more mobile. Um gonna toss that pink jig around a little more. Who knows man? Maybe I'll catch some crappie or maybe I'll keep slaying the perch. I mean I had a pretty good 10 minutes when I got here. I was doing really nice and then just absolute nothing so stick these rods back in our bag maybe maybe another time we'll come out here and the bass and pickerel bite will be a little nicer but i don't want to stick you guys with two fish so i'm gonna go back towards the pan fish pan fishing expedition i'm gonna move over to this little cove right around here uh make a few casts uh I, there are some lumber around here and then there's another point over there, so. I'm not feeling like I'm gonna get skunked. But, would definitely be awesome to land a few more fish before I have to call it a day. Fish on. That's a good something. That's a good something. Ooh, 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 ooh. I don't know what it is, but it's nice. It's nice. It's nice. Oh, nice crop, dude. Nice. Oh, yes. Nice, dude. Freaking on fire with these panfish, bro. On fire. Look at that, dude. Awesome fish. Solid crappie, dude. Solid. Beautiful colors. Pull out the phone. Snappy. A few quick pictures of them before we release them. Awesome fish, dude. Awesome. There we go, guys. Beautiful. Look at that crappie right there. Absolute beautiful looking fish. Um, as you can see behind me, guys, sun's setting. It's pretty dark out here. The geese are rowdy as always. Um, we're gonna let this dude go. Awesome. Crushed it. Third cast. Fought. Fought. Awesome. Definitely thought it was a little bass in that ultralight, but um, let's give him a release. And I'm definitely gonna catch some more fish. I can feel it. Absolutely stoked to catch that fish. Um, fall awesome on the ultralight, on that little uh, pink crappie jig. Gonna keep making a few more casts and hopefully catch some more guys. All right, last cast right there. It's freezing, it's dark. I gotta go catch some fish real quick and right here it's not producing right now, so. Gonna wrap this up real quick. Gonna go take a quick ride right down there, right through those trees. There's a little dock over there. Um, like a little boardwalk, I guess you could say. I'm gonna go try to fish that for some crappie because I know some stuff hangs around there, especially in the winter time.
there's a crappie. All right, fourth fish of the day. Little tiny crappie, beautiful fish. Um, right here at the dock, just jigging around and doing pretty good so far, so. I am gonna cast a few more times over around this dam over here, walking down over here, and I don't know, dude. We'll see I catch some nice crappies around this. All right, guys, that's a wrap. I managed to catch four fish by the end of the day. Um, just another short video for you guys. I mean, I haven't been getting out late. When I have, just been getting skunked. Um, I went down the shore a few times. Nothing there to tog or stripers. Uh, there's a nice schoolie bite right around now, so hopefully this weekend I get out there. It's gonna be like 30 something, but still love to catch some uh, striped bass. Yeah, I, I did go out like last week to catch some wild trout, and uh, that's not gonna make it into a video just because I didn't really catch like a ton of fish in one day. I fished for like five days and caught like three trout maybe. But um, follow me on Instagram right here, there at Dylan L. Fishing. Just to give you guys some updates, like let you know what's going on. Let you know if I'm getting out, what I'm catching, where, uh, and what I'm catching it on, like what the bite is in certain areas. But um, I'm gonna try to get out some more, try to do some more cold water fishing, cause that's the only thing that's really around right now. I mean, it's early December. Uh, yeah guys, thanks for watching. Caught those four fish, two of each species, two black crappie, two white, uh, yellow perch, and yeah guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoy, and I'll see you guys next week.